much time do we have? We have oh, yeah, 10 more minutes, so we're just going to do one advice. Mm. Um, we're going to go financial or romantic? I'll go romantic. A romantic. I th- I'm a romantic, not a fan, more than I'm a financial okay. person. Okay, let's see. Um, girls are cheating on her boyfriend, but I'm not sure I should get involved by ta- telling him. Mm. Okay. Um, there's a girl uh, that I know, there's a girl at work, there's a girl at work a few weeks ago and we started seeing each other outside of work. I didn't see any problem uh, because uh, she never told me she had a boyfriend. However, her boyfriend turned up at work yesterday and picked her up because uh, we had a long day. I chatted him for a moment while he was waiting for her and he was really, it was really awkward. He seems like a decent guy as well. Uh, and now I feel really bad. Should I, just, should I just leave it to them or should I tell them what's been going on? I'll be honest, really like her, but the fact that she's kept me, um, she kept him from, she kept this from me, made me upset, and I'm going mad all day thinking about it. I'd say you should, what do you think? I don't know. This, this is, this becomes a very, from a very high, high talk, we become, we go very low, at very low low. So I'd I, say, I don't know. What do you think? I don't know. Okay. I've had friends that have been in polyamorous relationships. Okay. You know? For those people, it seems to have worked. Mm. So, y- it needs to be a mature conversation, you know? Yeah. Assume, I, I don't know. To me, that story seems, seems a bit weird because it seems like is like is the other guy genuinely not aware and if he's genuinely not aware then yeah that's a big problem but all that needs to basically happen is a mature conversation that's the cha- that's the solution to like 99% of relationship problems is two adults need to sit and talk to one another yeah i agree i think well i think he needs to talk to her about it first yeah i think just uh, listen to her, like is he what's going on with this guy is he your boyfriend and try to figure out like if she's like, you can see there are signs of her lying to you too. So you, you mm. could know. That's so. a red flag for me. Yeah. So. But not like a, not like a. Yeah. Look, put it this way: if if she if she, if she's genuinely cheating on him, she'll cheat on you too. Yeah. So that's pretty. That's pretty awful. When, like when she's gonna be miserable, she's gonna cheat on you, instead yeah. of opening and talk about it in a mature conversation. So it's a, it's a red flag. I would have a mature conversation just be like, hey, so like, is he aware of me and how we're going? And like, if the answer is no, then that's very bad. Mm -hmm. If the answer is yes, then like, it's, it's a good thing you had a conversation then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Yeah. now you know, now you know what's going on and then you could have a better educated decision. The wrong decision is to do nothing. Oh, do not do nothing. Do not do nothing. nothing. You're just like kicking the ball down, (laughs) you know, like, Yeah. Okay. Uh, 